Hola, friends, and welcome back to the lab. There has been a new update, and I have been creating in the laboratory here, experimenting with musical heads and all kinds of fun stuff. And we have developed something that we can have fun with. It's not that hard to build. And it's a drum machine. So if you want to start making your own music, we can start off by making some killer beats. And I'm going to walk you through making your very own drum machine. And afterwards, I'll show you a little music video to wrap up the end of the video of me using my drum machine. So let's get started. For this build, we are going to need the percussion tote bot head. We're going to need some horns, which we're going to use as mallets. I already got them there, but I'll put them there again. We're also going to need some sensors. Um, what else? We're going to use some steel, because I think that looks nice. And I don't think there's really that much else we need. Oh! How can we forget? I need some duckies. Don't worry, no duckies are going to be hurt or injured in the creating of this video. So let's lay down a nice tile piece of floor. And what we're going to do is we're going to put a... I like to use wood. Let's use a wooden piece here. Yeah, we can put that there. We'll put a wooden piece up here. Like so. Another wooden piece, actually. It would look even better with the pipes. What am I thinking? What am I thinking? You're probably going, Chief, you are so disorganized today. Well, Chief has gone with very little sleep lately because this new update has kept him playing the game all night, doing all kinds of fun and crazy stuff. So, I'm gonna put a pipe there. I'm gonna leave four spaces. I'm gonna put a pipe there. I'm gonna put another thing there, like this. Can you see the other way? Like we're making a towel rack or something. Oh, I need a bearing. Something else I forgot. As you can see, this is one of those one-take wonders I'm doing. Um, okay, I don't think we're going to need any more of those. Bearing goes there. And... Oh, I want to get the wood. Oh, barrier. I want barriers so much, but we're going to use wood. Okay. Now for real, real. For finally, we're going to put the wood across here like this, connected to the bearing. And now, we're getting pretty close here. This is starting to look like our drum machine. Next thing we need, let's put a block here like this. Maybe, maybe not. How right about there? I'm so confused. Let's put one there. Yeah, I think that's where I want it. I think. Wow. See, this is what happens when Chief goes for a very long time without sleep. Chief gets very confused very easy. Alright. I remember now. We need springies. Happy springies, the little ones. Yes, the little springs. All right, this may be one of those videos that don't actually get published, guys. We'll see how that turns out. I'm going to put 
my duckies here. Just like that. On the springies. And then the mallets. I put the soft side of the mallet down because I don't want to hit the duck with that hard part there. I don't want to hurt the duck. Like I said, no ducks are to be injured in this video. Okay. Let me add. Gosh, the ball has to go the right way. I don't want to hurt the duck. Okay, this one's going the wrong way. There we go. Okay, so those will spin around, hit the ducky on the head, and the ducky will go quack. So the next thing I need are my sensors. Sensors go right here. Perfect. I didn't even need to use Q. I love it when that happens. And the next thing we're gonna do, we're gonna put right to behind. No, not behind the sensor because that makes it so complicated to adjust the sensor. There we go. Now, each one of these sensors, this is important. You want to set it to number one. And you want to turn the sound off. This is so important. I'm going to make you watch this four times. Turn it to one, turn the sound off. How important is it? It's this important, that you gotta turn it to one and turn the sound off because we're making a drum machine and we don't want the sensors going bleep, 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 bleep all over the place when we're trying to hear our awesome beats. All right? There, the sensors are done. The next thing we need to do is connect our controller the bearing and um, let's add our little drum beat heads because we can't make drum beats. Oh, I already have that. So we need four drum beat heads. One, face the, face me, please. Don't don't turn away from me. One, two, three, four. Excellent. This one connects to the first sensor. You can connect these any way you want because you're going to choose the sounds and you're going to make up the beat for it. And this one goes to there. And this one will go to the last ducky thing there. So let's put another mallet. I don't know. We'll put one here. We'll put one, and we'll put two here. I think that might make a nice beat. Oh, okay, that'll be my snare. Okay, so I connected all these already. The one with all of them. There's a little music tip. You want your snare to be the one going the fastest. That's why that has four there. That's connected to top one here. So we'll make this snare. No, I mean hi-hat. What was I saying? Hi-hat. It needs to be hi-hat. The hi-hat's the one that goes really fast. Click, 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 click. Okay. The next one, which is just like one every round, that should be, that should be the snare. We pick a nice snare. Yeah, I like that. The next one, be the downbeat. Double down beat or a single down beat? I don't know. Kick. Oh, I like that. I like that kick. And the last one. Oh, I'm gonna sneeze. Oh my goodness. Oh, don't you hate that? When you feel like you're gonna sneeze, but then the sneeze goes away? Okay, serious. Three. Okay. Our drum machine. Can you believe that? How quick and easy it got ready? If it wasn't for all my shenanigans, we could have gotten this done even faster. But, like I said, not feeling so great. I'm getting better though. My cold comes and goes, sore throat, cough, comes and goes, but check it out. We've got our duckies, right, ready to be pounded with the hammers so that they can quack out an awesome beat. Well, actually they won't be quacking out the beat, they'll be triggering the sensor and the sensor will be true. Well, you know, you guys are smart. I have the smartest 
subscribers and random watchers ever. So let's set up a switch because we need a switch now. It ain't gonna happen without a switch. Let me put a little pillar here. Put a switch on it, just like so. Let me connect the switch to the controller. One more thing we need to do the controller. Fast infinity button and go all the way around 360 just like that. Now let's see. This makes music. Let's press the E. Oh, wait a minute. We got defect here. It's going the wrong way. Make sure that it spins that way. Look at that. Look at that. Our awesome drum machine got ready so quick. Four duckies. Hit the button. Boom. Chicka boom. Chicka boom. Yeah, 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 yeah. You guys want to make a drum machine? Totally awesome drum machine. That's all you need. Couple of ducks, couple of yellow blockheads, some sensors, and you could adjust the beat any way you want. You could even turn it off, go back over here to your beat maker stick, and put, say, you want to put mallet up here. Or you want to put a double there, put a mallet there like that. Then you can put one there and then it'll go like this. Changed up the beat, yo. So, anything you could imagine. Create any beat you want. Totally awesome drum machine. Now, we're going to wrap this up with my music video, which I created out of all Scrap Mechanic music stuff, and hope you enjoy it. So long.